Political patronage presupposes that those who labor for electoral victory are rewarded with appointments. As such, the coordinators of support groups of the All Progressive Congress APC Presidential Campaign Council have appealed to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu to appoint people from the pool of supporters who were part of the campaign team before and during the elections. At a joint meeting with the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, that uh, Judge Akumen, they presented their grievance over poor reward system of APC since inception. Let's share the story from TVC News correspondent Abidat Lawa with you. Today, political parties are still faced with the hangover of the afflictions of a reward system as nearly all the existing parties in the current dispensation could hardly boast of institutionalizing an effective party machinery that is completely free from the negative effect of interference in its administration by some powerful forces. This is why it does not have in place the mechanism to recognize and reward loyal party members for their dedication to the ideals and philosophy of the party. In the 2023 election, the All Progressives Congress had the larger support group base than any other political party. Represented here are over 5,000 support groups at an interface with the SGF, Judge Akume, to register their displeasure at how the APC administration reward system has remained unfavorable. This is a government they work for. This is a government they believe in. And uh, they should please exercise patience. We are less than six months in office. And they should be patient. But as politicians, they find that under Buhari eight years, to the same education, education, that this time around, that for the fact that the person they work for is really a fighter, is somebody that against all odds came out and said this primary is not going to be back consensus, that they are sure that it's not aware of what is happening, that they will do what they want to do. So we pleaded and uh, Mr. Chris reach out to me that I should reach out to them to put them together. <laughs> you also Use your resources to ensure victory for the party. You recall what the enemies of progress did shortly before the commencement of the national elections, the Naira were designed for us. Which policy was basically designed? Our candidate and distribute this. We're denying our funds. <coughs> Why our opponents benefited immensely from what constituted our own demand. They were generously funded. The only fear we have is the future of this administration. That is why I pray that this meeting and every information garnered at this meeting can get to the table of Ashwaju himself. Because we are running to one year in this administration very soon. The second year, after the second year, it is strictly politics of the nearest future. The blackmail about Ashwaju's administration is so much. Where do we throw the 69 days that we converge at Uni Fountain without without going to our home early, getting there in the morning, coordinating people because of the oppositions that wants to use the avenue to blackmail Ashwaju, because of the opposition that want to frustrate the prelude to the swearing of Ashwaju, we took our decision on faith and belief in that cause and belief in the fact that Ashwaju can perform extensively to stay in Unity Fountain <laughs> for 69 days. They argue that the reason for the dearth in competence necessary to solve national problems is the persistence in rewarding people without any objective criteria. President Bola Ahmed Tinubu is urged to establish an essential nexus between reward systems, political party loyalty, political stability and development. Support groups remain an integral part of a support base of any political party and as such, concerns raised here remains valid and germane to the growth and prosperity of the APC. 
Habida Lawao, TVC News, Abuja.